Ladies and gentlemen, his name is Alex McAleer, <laughs> and he's a mind reader set to perform at the upcoming Champions of Magic show at Old National Center in November. Yes, and Alex, from what we understand, this is live entertainment like we have never seen before. 100%. Yeah. Welcome, man. Ah, it's nice to be here. Thank yes, you for having me, guys. Yes, absolutely. I appreciate it. Yeah, so this is like, it's it's live magic. Like, a lot of people have seen magic, but they've oh. only seen it on TV yeah. or on Instagram or TikTok or something like that. But seeing it live is an entirely different experience. And in this show, you get to see kind of every type of magic as I well. Bet. Yeah. And to be a mind reader, does one have to be in close proximity physically? To read the mind of your subject. Uh, yes, okay. like over you know over 2020, people try to you know I tried to do stuff over Zoom and stuff, it just didn't work. Not There's too much effective. delay. But yeah, I need to meet people in person and, and okay. read them and see them and you know yeah. get to know them. What, okay. what are some of your favorite reactions from audience members? Because I think I, I feel like I would be fascinated, you know, with what I'm seeing on stage, and that has to just make you even more like okay, let, let's yeah. do this, you know. Like 100%. That's why you get started. So when you first start learning any kind of magic tricks, the first thing you get hooked on is the response that you get from people I bet. freaking out. You know, we've had people. You know, use expletives on stage, which is not good for a family show. I like Just pull the it. mic away. I like the word expletives. Expletives. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds better. <laughs> you get a gen it gives you a general gist. Yeah. But yeah, or people just go to shock silence. We had one woman uh, faint once as well. Oh, wow. That was in the UK. Oh, but my goodness. Uh, I'm sure she was fine. But I mean, this I is a whole production, as we can see from the video. Yeah, it's a huge show. So you can see there's huge lighting and pyrotechnics. Yeah. And as I said, there's every type of magic. You get to see, like, escapology, which is, you know, escapes, like Houdini. Oh, yeah. You get to the big okay. illusions, you see mind reading, close up magic. It's kind of a fun family I, event. I well, feel like we should do a little well, something. Yeah, and I, do and I, don't, I don't want to put a bunch of pressure on you, Alex, but um, we've had this sort of ongoing discussion here about whether Amber's having a boy <laughs> or a girl. Mm -hmm. She knows what she's having. Right. She has not shared that with us. No. Um, now, I, I realize that it's probably difficult for a mind reader if she doesn't want this information out. Yes, that's true. Yes. Uh, but I think she might be willing to let you read her sure. mind. Sure. I can, yes. Can we try something? Okay. I also say now that Alex is a great name for a boy or a girl. <laughs> that's true. That's, that's true. true. And Randy's, Randy already. also says Randy is a that's good name true. for a boy or a girl. That's true. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want a girl named Randy. Yeah. <laughs> it's going to lead to some issues. Um, so, yeah, can I try something with you? Yes, yes, Now, yes. for people watching, we haven't set anything up, we haven't prearranged anything. No. 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 Okay. So, I want you, please, to think of, uh, nothing to do with a baby, uh, okay. I want you to think of the name of uh, a childhood friend. Okay. Someone you remember from, you know, your school days yes. or something like that. Okay. So, don't worry about their last name, because last names can be easy to guess, you know, like Smith or Jones or something. Yeah. Do you have someone in mind? Yes. Yes. Okay. I'm going to need you to write this down. Okay. Just so we've got some proof later on. I have a piece of card. Should have a pen, I do. Okay. So just their first name, remember. Write it down here. Don't show any of the cameras yet. Okay. Just in case there's monitors that I might be able to okay. see. And when okay. you're done, just fold it back up. So write just their name fold there. It. Okay. And I'll look the other way. I'll push my eyes closed. You know, there's absolutely no way I can see what you're writing. I'll keep talking, see if anything I can hear, how the okay. pen is moving, or however it is that people think this sort of stuff works. <laughs> uh -huh. And tell me when you're done. I'm done. Okay. Now, uh, you can keep the pen. Okay. I stole it from a hotel earlier. Okay. And, like, this is a, a thick piece of card. Yes, yeah. yes it is. See so. through it, but we're going to keep it in this envelope. Please make sure there's nothing else inside mm. okay. there. Else, yeah. And we're going to switch it or swap it. It goes in. You can hold it okay. like that. Okay. I'll try my best to try and get as close as I can to this name. So if you look at me, okay. and just in your head, you just keep saying this name over and over okay. again. Don't say it out loud, because that's too easy. Too easy. Good. Okay. Okay. So, uh, without giving too much away, is this from like elementary school days or yeah, yes. quite young? Okay. Yes. So, and do you still know this person? Yes. Yes. Okay. Mostly yes. on Facebook and that sort of stuff. Yeah. Um. So so. Yeah. So so. Okay. I don't see them often. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so it's old school friend. Yeah. Just keep saying their name in your head and imagine they're back at school and they've taken a piece of chalk or a okay. whiteboard marker or whatever and they've written their name on the on the chalkboard at the end of the class. Okay. And the teacher's out the room or something like that. And you can really see that. So that first letter is either a T or a J. J? It's a J, isn't it? Nope. Is it a T? Yes. It's a T. Okay, it's a T. So it doesn't curl. It's a T. Uh -huh. um, could you say, I'm, gonna, I'm not going to get this exactly. I'm going to get <laughs> as close as I can. Is it like um, Tully or Tully or something like that? Mm -mm. No, what is it? I don't think I'm going to get this. I'm so sorry. <laughs> it's, I mean, it's close. The T's right. What, what is it? You have to tell. I'm sorry. I'm not Tina. Gonna get it. Tina. Yes. Oh, <laughs> Tina, of course. Okay. That's yes, as close Tina. as I can. I'm so sorry. It's <laughs> early uh, for a mind reader. Oh, that's okay. That's okay. <laughs> it's only fine. <laughs> All right, dude. Is she having a boy or a girl? <laughs> oh, you said. I didn't hear it. Can we, can we tell the audience? Nope. No? It's our little no. secret. Yeah. We're in the secret no. circle. <laughs> no. Hey, I, I 
was that was good though. That was that whole thing. That was yeah. real. That was not. I mean, I was standing right here. Yeah. That was he was really. There, he was yeah. picturing stuff. Yeah. That was cool. <laughs> so. What is George and L.A. thinking? Right. Some, well, now you, I now I know. I wish I could get into now people's I, minds, now I right? Know. So I can I can go shopping now. So. Oh oh oh! He's gonna go shopping for me, Randy. Did you hear that? Randy. He's going shopping. Randy. I write down the name Randy. Randy could be boy or girl, right? <laughs> you just never know. Really. 